Hi guys, welcome to the Savvy Professor and in today's video, we are going to find out how to get Airtable's API key. For this, simply open your Airtable and log in to your project that you've been working on. So you don't need to go out of your project in order to find your API key. You can simply come and work on your project and whenever you want to find API key, you will have to simply click on this account button at the top right corner. Click on this profile icon that is accounts button and here we'll get this drop down menu. We have accounts, notification language, contact sales, upgrade, telefriend, integrations and developer hub. You will have to basically click on developer hub and this will open a new window on your Airtable. And here we have these options personal access tokens, API key, auth integrations, web API documentation and community. So we have the option for API key just right here. Click on API key and you'll find your API key just right here if you have any. And here we'll see this message that says API keys will be deprecated by the end of January 2024. After this date, API keys will stop working and you will have to migrate to personal access tokens. Personal access tokens allow you to more securely grant API access to Airtable data. You can click on create token if you want to create a personal token that is going to replace the API keys by the end of January 2024. So basically I don't have any API keys and if you want to create tokens instead of API keys that serves the same function, click on create token and here it will prompt us to this page where we'll click on create token and name the token anything that you want and click on scopes and select the scopes for your token and then click on add base and select your base that you've been working on and click on create token. After that, we'll have successfully created our token and this token will only be shown once. You'll have to copy it and store it in a safe and secure location. Only use this token for your own development. Don't share it with third party services and applications. Click on the copy button and basically go to any text editor or your sticky notes and paste this token here in order to access it in future. So make sure you store this token and get back and now click on done. So here we have created our personal access token instead of API key that is going to shut down soon. So if you want to find your API key, if you have any, you will find it just right here. And now if you want to go back to your base, click on go to my basis at the top right corner and here we are back to our basis. So that's how you can basically get your API key on Airtable, like and subscribe if you found this video helpful.